The Fair Commodore is a 4 to 6 berth, 35 foot cruiser available from Norfolk Broads Direct. The boat is of a modern design with sleek lines and is on the whole well laid out. The boat features dual steering positions and bow thrusters, making it a versatile and very easy boat to manoeuvre, especially when mooring or when turning in a tight position. Very good for those who are boating for the first time. Let's take a look on board starting with the two cabins. In the bow cabin you have two single berths that will convert to a double bed if needed. There are small storage areas below the berths along with a good sized closet to the right as you enter the cabin. There's also a mirror and handy coat hooks. The starboard cabin has a good sized double bed. It also has a sizeable closet along with a set of drawers and your very own TV. Bedding is provided along with hand and shower towels, but we would recommend that you maybe bring along a few extra towels if you're on the boat for a week or two. So onto the main saloon where you'll find the last double berth, which is easily converted from the main seating and table area. And to prove this, I was able to make the bed up and return it to its seating in just around three and a half minutes. We also found that there is an extra bit of storage underneath the seating that you could use to store a small case or two. Now it is worth pointing out that we were on the Fair Commodore for two nights and both Eastie and myself found our respective beds to be surprisingly comfortable and very roomy. In fact, more comfortable than many hotel beds that we'd stayed in. That's not bad for a couple of guys with ample midriffs and one of us being six foot two. The galley or kitchen is a typical size for this kind of cruiser. So if you're boating for the first time, you might find it a little tight, but you'll soon get used to it and you'll be frying up a breakfast before you know it. Actually, the Fair Commodore is well equipped with everything you might expect in a kitchen, including a four ring gas cooker with oven and grill and even a microwave. There is also a full sized fridge which is cleverly placed in the saloon area. Bread bin, pots, pans, dishes, plates, cutlery and a good selection of cooking utensils are all provided, as are glasses and the all important teapot and kettle. And to our relief, we also found a corkscrew and bottle opener. Norfolk Broads Direct thoughtfully provide washing up liquid, scourers and J-cloths. Of course, these are the typical sorts of things we will forget. Okay, heading up to the saloon area, we of course have the earlier mentioned seating and table, along with a TV, DVD and a PS2 complete with two controllers for the kids. We didn't find any PS2 games, so we assume you'll need to bring these along. There are a couple of drawers and cupboards, one of which contains a safe big enough to hold keys and any valuables, which really does offer peace of mind when leaving the boat. You then have the lower steering position, where you'll also find a well-equipped music centre with radio and iPhone and iPod docking cable. Nice touch. Norfolk Broads Direct also provide a very detailed manual covering everything you'll need to know about the boats along with important information such as where and how to dump your rubbish. You're also provided with a map free of charge along with some helpful brochures on where to visit. There are also two bathrooms on board. The first is en suite to the rear cabin with a toilet, sink and very nice shower. Eastie said that he had no troubles with his 6 foot 2 frame and the earlier mentioned ample midriff. In fact, he found it quite roomy. The second bathroom is between the lower steering position and forward cabin. This was smaller and some adults may find it a little cramped. In fact, at five foot 10, I found it very hard to stand and shower in there, but it is perfect for kids. Again, Norfolk Wards Direct thoughtfully provide a roll of loo paper in each bathroom. And there is also, of course, hot water and heating throughout. On the upper deck, you'll find the second steering position where you have full control, including our much loved bow thrusters. This is an excellent position for relaxing and watching the broad slowly pass you by. Our only concern was that although the Fair Commodore features a large sunbathing area, this does restrict outside seating. So other than the double seat at the steering position, there is no other outside seating. But hey, you might like that if you prefer to lay on deck and soak up the rays. We're not sure that this boat would comfortably berth six adults for any real length of time but it could be perfect for four good friends and is most certainly a great family boat. All in all, the Fair Commodore is a beautifully designed and comfortable cruiser that is further enhanced by the company's little touches. It's well equipped with the essentials and because of its steering positions and bow thrusters, it is incredibly easy to maneuver and more. To find out more and for pricing on the Fair Commodore, 
go to norfolkbroadsdirect.co.uk. And to find more boat reviews, places to visit and where to eat and drink on the Broads, make sure you subscribe to us at www.thebroads.tv. We'll see you soon.